లెఫ్ట్ సైడ్ ఉన్నటువంటి సబ్స్క్రైబ్ బటన్ను క్లిక్ చేయడం ద్వారా మరియు పక్కనే వచ్చినటువంటి గంట సింబల్ని ప్రెస్ చేయడం ద్వారా మీరు మన ఛానల్లో పెట్టినటువంటి మంచి సైన్స్ వీడియోస్ని మీ మొబైల్ నోటిఫికేషన్ ద్వారా చూడడానికి అవకాశం ఉంటుంది థ్యాంక్ యూ ప్లీజ్ వెల్కమ్ టు టెక్నో సైన్స్ క్లబ్ టు డేస్ అవర్ ఇంపార్టెంట్ అండ్ ఇంట్రెస్టింగ్ టాపిక్ ఇన్ టెన్త్ క్లాస్ లెసన్ కెమికల్ బాండింగ్ covalent compound what is meant by covalent compound how the covalent compound is covalent bond is formed and what are the example for the covalent bond let's see in this video and also some uh, previous classes in previous classes some videos are done on a chemical bonding lesson if you not seen that videos please uh, i'm leaving a link in description and also in cards and also the end of this video the links of that videos are uh, displayed so please uh, watch that videos and please uh, see this video until the end please like share and subscribe let's go into the topic chemical bonding there is a two types of chemical bondings are there one is ionic bond we learn about the ionic bond how the ionic bond is formed and uh, what is the examples for the ionic bond and what is the factors affecting ionic bond in previous videos if you have not seen that videos uh, please uh, uh, there is a links in description box please see that videos and also there is a links in uh, cards also please see that videos and in today we learn second type of chemical bonding that is a covalent bond what is covalent bond and how the covalent bond is formed what is the examples for the covalent bonds more examples for the covalent bonds first of all in 1916 g m lewis we know that lewis lewis dotted structures for the molecules lewis introduced that lewis proposed that there is some atoms which are at attains octa electronic configuration achieve octa electronic configuration by sharing of electrons not transferring not giving of electrons or not gaining of electrons some atoms are there those atoms achieve their uh, outermost shell electronic configuration stable electronic configuration or octa electronic configuration by sharing of electrons he said that this is sharing of electrons by this sharing of electrons a bond is formed between the atoms that bond is called covalent bond the bond formed between the two atoms by sharing of electrons is called covalent bond for example fluorine is taken as an example in fluorine the fluorine electronic configuration atomic number of fluorine electronic configuration of fluorine is 27 if one electron is there for fluorine it will get a stable electronic configuration another fluorine atom is also there these fluorine atoms are also needed one electron to get stability these uh, two fluorine atoms are there uh, these two fluorine atoms need one one electron to get stability there is no another atoms are there to give one electron for these two fluorine atoms there is no another atoms then these two fluorine atoms are comes to an understand understanding and form a pair of electrons with their lone pair of electrons the fluorine one fluorine has a one electron one lone pair of a, one lonely electron in their outermost shell another uh, fluorine atom is fluorine atom is also having a uh, one lonely electron in their outermost shell these two fluorine atoms are comes an understanding and uh, form a lone pair of electrons one electron from uh, one fluorine atom and another electron from another fluorine atoms and form a pair of electrons these uh, pair of electrons are sharing by these two fluorine atoms and these two fluorine atoms get stability by sharing these uh, middle electron pair 
so by sharing these electron pair these flu two fluorine atoms are uh, get stabled then and bond is formed a bond is formed between the fluorine atoms this type of bond by sharing of electrons there is a bond between the fluorine atoms this type of bond is called covalent bond let's take another example for this covalent bond oxygen let understand let's see that fluorine oxygen nitrogen these three are said to be diatomic molecules because in nature these two these are three and also there is some type of molecules are there these molecules are in nature their molecules are fluorine oxygen and nitrogen etc etc these are the diatomic molecules in nature so it has a two two atoms are there in between these two two atoms there is a covalent bonds are there in fluorine 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 atom the bond between one one covalent bond is there between the fluorine and fluorine atom in oxygen there is a covalent bonds but a two covalent bonds there between the oxygen atoms let's see this oxygen the electron configuration of oxygen is 2 comma 6 it are its atomic number is 8 so the electronic configuration is 2 6 if oxygen having two electrons from any other another, another atom it will be stable another oxygen atom oxygen atom is also this type these two oxygen atoms need two two electrons to get stability any other atoms are not ready to give two two electrons to this oxygen atoms so these two oxygen atoms comes to an understanding and forms two pair of electrons in between them and share that two pair of electrons and get stabled in this way the oxygen another oxygen forms a two pair of electrons in between and these two pair of electrons are shared by this oxygen and by this oxygen also and get stabled a double bond two covalent bonds are formed between the oxygen and oxygen atom two covalent bonds are formed in between the two oxygen atoms in the oxygen molecule another example for the covalent bond is also formation of nitrogen molecule in this nitrogen molecule has an electronic configuration of 2 5 it needs three electrons one al one nitrogen atom and another nitrogen atom these two needed a three three electrons to get stability there is no another any atoms are not given these three three electrons to them so they comes an understanding and forms three pair of electrons in between them and share these three pair of electrons in between them and form stable atoms like this nitrogen atom get a three lone pair of electrons this nitrogen atom get three lone pair of electrons and form a three pair of electrons and share uh, these two nitrogen atoms and get stability there is a three covalent bonds are bond covalent bonds are form in between the nitrogen and nitrogen atoms so in fluorine there is a single covalent bond is there in oxygen there is a double bond is there double covalent bond is there and in nitrogen there is a triple bond is there triple covalent bond is there these uh, fluorine oxygen nitrogen are uh, atoms of same element in between the atoms of same element there is a covalent bond formation is there and in between the different different atoms are also having a covalent bond example for this covalent bond example methane methane is also an example for the covalent bond ch4 the formula the formula for the methane is a ch4 in ch4 molecule carbon has a electronic configuration of 2 4 so its atomic number is 6 so the electronic configuration of carbon is a 2 4 so it a example for the formation of a covalent bond another example for the formation of covalent bond is a methane ch4 in ch4 carbon has a four unpaired electrons there in their outermost shell and hydrogen has a one lone pair uh, lonely electron is there four hydrogens having four uh, unpaired electrons and carbon has four unpaired electrons in between these uh, four pairs are formed 
and shared by the hydrogen atoms and the carbon atoms by sharing between the carbon atom and the hydrogen atoms there is a four covalent bonds are formed like this hydrogen you get stability by sharing these two and another hydrogen another hydrogen another hydrogen these four hydrogens are get stable stability and uh, middle carbon has also get stability by sharing these uh, four pair of electrons so there is a four covalent bonds are the form in between the carbon and hydrogen atoms in a methane molecule ch4 these four are covalent bonds so another example for the covalent bond is ammonia in ammonia molecules one nitrogen atom is there three hydrogen atoms are there nitrogen atom electronic configuration 2 comma 5 if a uh, hydrogen electronic configuration 1 1 1 each hydrogen have a uh, one uh, unpaired electrons and the nitrogen have three unpaired electrons if three pair of uh, if three electrons are uh, there the nitrogen will be stable so nitrogen and hydrogens are uh, form three pair of electrons in between them and share that pair of electrons by sharing the nitrogen get bonding with the three hydrogen atoms and get a stability and get a three covalent bonds between the nitrogen and hydrogen like this so in nit in ammonia also there is a three covalent bonds in methane there is a four covalent bonds in methane and ammonia these are the atoms of different different uh, molecules different different elements so at the last one is example for the covalent bond is h2o water molecule in water molecule also oxygen has an electronic configuration of a uh, 26 it has a uh, two unpaired electrons and uh, two hydrogens are there each hydrogen has a uh, one lonely electron in their outermost shell so oxygen and these two hydrogens are come to an understanding and form two bonds uh, two pair of electrons in between them and uh, has uh, two covalent bonds in between them h2o the oxygen get stability by sharing these two pair of electrons and hydrogen get also this type of hydrogen get also stable and oxygen is also stable by sharing of these a pair of electrons in this way there is a two covalent bonds are formed between the oxygen and hydrogen molecules so in this way there is a covalent bonds are formed between the atoms when there is no source to gain electrons from the outermost uh, from the other molecules other uh, elements other elements or atoms so in that situation the covalent bond is formed by sharing of electrons in between them same molecules uh, same atoms or uh, different different atoms so the sharing of electrons the bond formed between the atoms by the sharing of electrons is called a covalent bond these are the examples for the covalent bond fluorine oxygen nitrogen diatomic molecules methane ch4 ammonia nh3 water h2o in these uh, all molecules having covalent bonds so one one molecule have one covalent bond another molecule has double bond another nitrogen have triple bond and methane have uh, four bonds are there and the ammonia have three covalent bonds water molecule have two covalent bonds in this type in this class we learn about what is meant by covalent bond how the covalent bond is formed and uh, examples for the covalent bond fluorine oxygen nitrogen methane ammonia water etc etc uh, if you like this video please uh, like and share to your friends through the social media and please subscribe our channel and please the press the bell symbol to get the notifications of our channel thank you thank you for watching please like share and subscribe thank you thank you for watching jai hind
ఈ వీడియో కనుక మీకు నచ్చినట్లయితే లైక్ చేయండి షేర్ చేయండి కామెంట్ చేయండి సబ్స్క్రైబ్ చేయడం మాత్రం మర్చిపోకండి